We're almost 11 months into the pandemic and more than 5,000 COVID related deaths have now been reported in Arkansas. Appreciate you joining us tonight on THV 11 News at 6. I'm Roly Hoyt. Governor Asa Hutchison called the milestone disappointing. 24 deaths came in over the last 24 hours, bringing the state's death toll to 5,009. In today's update, the governor encouraged everyone to let this unfortunate news serve as a reminder that our actions, especially following health guidelines, do make a difference. We also saw another significant jump in our case numbers today. 2,469 new infections reported since yesterday. There is some positive news to come out of today's update. After a slight increase yesterday, our hospitalizations are back down again. 815 Arkansans are still battling the virus from a hospital bed. That's 69 fewer than yesterday's total. Now, allergies are kicking in, giving us some sneezes and coughs. And almost a year into this, it's still hard to know for sure if those symptoms are COVID or what else. So THV 11's Jordan Howington finds out when it's the right time to go get tested. Well, this is very typical. This is February. Bernie Kurtz is a senior horticulturist at the U of A Extension Service. He says it should be no secret by now. Allergens are in the air. He finds out it's mostly elm and cedar pollen, and it's not coming from our local landscape. These warm fronts we've been getting from the Gulf Coast are bringing the pollen to us. Dr. Stacy Griffin at Little Rock Allergy and Asthma Clinic says these allergens stirring in the air are already making some of us feel under the weather. And with allergies, you may feel bad uh, just from your your environmental allergy symptoms, the itchy red, watery eyes. But dealing with allergy symptoms during the COVID pandemic, Dr. Griffin says can be a little scary because both COVID-19 and allergies share some of the same. Uh, well, cough can be seen in both. The one symptom that sets the two apart is a fever. If you have a fever, that's when you should go get a COVID-19 test. Dr. Griffin says fever is very rare with allergies and the cough linked to COVID-19 is more dry with much less mucus. But he says if you need to chat with a health care provider, they'll always make time. Talk about your symptoms with your provider. Uh, just give a phone call and see. And most of the time they'll be able to tell you whether or not they think it's more the, you know, your average cough for cold or whether they think you should be screened for the COVID-19. In Little Rock, Jordan Howington, THV 11 News.